This program is intended for mature audiences and may contain some material that is not suitable for everyone, including violence, coarse language, and unfiltered opinions. We do not endorse the views of those we report on. You know, like I said, go away. God, you're a pest. Uh, like I said, though, I mean, you know, there's this thing called mukbang that's out there. M-U-K-B-A-N-G. And what is mukbang? Mukbang is a bunch of cute little Asian girls that, that eat huge fucking plates of food this fucking big. Not even making that shit up. And they get millions of views for it, too. It's called mukbang. M-U-K-B-A-N-G. Look it up. They get huge amounts of views. Because here's this little tiny four-foot-tall girl. And by the way, she is an adult. She just happens to be short. You know, the Asian girls, they tend to be skinny and short. And they tend to look very young also. But they're adults, I assure you. They're adults. Anyway, this one, this one in particular, she, she, had, she had a big plate of rice over here. She had a big plate of chicken over here. And then she had a big uh, walk. She had a big walk full of veggies, uh, steamed veggies over here. And so she mixes that shit up. And I'm sitting there. She's shoveling that shit in. And I'm like, where in the fuck is this chick putting that food? She ain't big as a minute. Where is she putting all that damn food? I mean, now I, I you know, when I was younger, I had a blast furnace for a stomach. But I had no, no big fucking plates this goddamn big. I mean, holy shit. Where in the world are they putting that food? So it was just, you know, it was, it was, it was, I was, I was mystified. It's like, where in the hell? I mean, I swear to you, the, 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 these, these, these girls are only like four foot, five foot tall. Where in the hell are they putting all that food? You just are, Brittany. Don't be doing that shit. Uh, you know, let Pearl be Pearl. If Pearl wants to jump off a cliff, don't join her. Okay. Because right now, you're talking about, okay, this latest video, talking about Pearl again. And your subs are not there to watch you talk about Pearl. They're wanting you to go back into the kitchen and, and cook some more because they enjoyed your cooking. I, I personally enjoyed your cooking videos. I loved them. Okay. Your cooking videos talk about politics, talk about religion. Hey, I just happen to know a guy that knows about a brand new religion on this planet. That would be an excellent topic for your for your program, Brittany. Just saying. But anyways, but yeah, get back to talking about you. Get back to talking about things that you enjoy, the things that you want to do. Uh, you know, cook some food. Uh, you know, talk about clothing. You, you know, that video you did about clothing. Very informative. Don't do like I did. Don't be like me. Talk about things that you want to do. Talk about things that interest you. We're not there to hear about Pearl. If we want to hear about Pearl, we'll go to Pearl's channel. Okay? Just some sage advice, Brittany, from somebody who had a channel on YouTube with six over 16,000 subs. And now does not. Now, granted, the trolls may have not been the only reasoning behind you know, my channel going, going down the shitter, but it was a significant factor. Okay, you can't change your modus operandi. But just in case you haven't gotten it, let me let me let me give you a crude drawing, okay? Because a lot of people don't get this shit. You say, well, what's the significance of it of it being flat instead of a ball? Well, the significance is is that if it's a ball, you're worshiping Helios, a Greek god, <laughs> whether you like it or not, whether you believe it or not. You're worshiping Helios, a Greek god, or you're at the very least giving him loyalty and fealty. All right. That's the truth because that's what the solar system is named after. It's called the heliocentric model. Well, who's Helios? He's a Greek god. Deal with it. All right. Let's get our uh, crude drawing going here. Now, I got my thing here. Okay, nice and big. Very good. Uh, let's see. What are we doing? Bright yellow. There we go. That'll work. All right. Now. Okay. So we got a sphere here, right? We got a ball. Okay. We got a ball. 
We got a sphere. We got a globe. Whatever. All right. Now. Here's a U.S. Navy ship, right? Actually, well, actually it would be, fuck. Actually it would be lower than that. Actually it'd be lower than that. Actually it'd be about right there. Okay, here's our ship, our, our U.S. Navy ship. And here's the target drone over here. All right? And there's, there, there's, your, there's your Navy ship and there's your target drone. Now, now, riddle me this, Batman. How the hell is a laser going to hit that target drone? No, it's not. No, it's not. The laser's going to go careening out into space because we're on a fucking globe. This drone is not going to get hit. No, it's not. No way. Not if we're on a ball. But the U.S. Navy laser tests consistently hit the drone miles away every single time. Okay, why? Because we're not on a ball. If we're on a ball, the laser's going to go careening out into space. Lasers don't bend. No, they do not. There is no phenomenon, none, no science that allows for a laser to bend. Okay, so if we're on a ball, the laser's going to go straight out into space, and the drone is going to just happily keep flying. Okay? Lasers don't bend. So this crap that we're on, a, we're on a ball is bullshit. We are not on a ball. We're on an infinite flat plane in all directions. And of that infinite flat plane, we are in a little petri dish consisting of, of our little area. Okay? And that's the truth. So, let's correct our, let's correct our mistake here. Yes. Let's correct our mistake here and put it back to the way it's supposed to be. Because a ball is a lie. A ball is a lie. U.S. Navy laser tests prove it. Prove it's a lie. We're on an infinite flat plane. And the laser goes from the naval ship and hits the target, destroying the target. That's what happened period there is no ball sorry but there's not sorry about your luck minor u.s navy laser tests do not lie 